Hello, my digital nomads. And in today's video, I'm going to be answering some of the comments that I've been getting, which is how to delete a file from Microsoft 365. Now I've had in the comment section, people ask me, they deleted it from Microsoft. They followed my guide and then it still shows up. So I'm about to fix that for you. All right. Let me just go ahead and show you what I'm talking about. So in one of the videos, if you ever use Microsoft 365, it's very difficult or it's hard to go ahead and delete your file because if you go into here and you know you go into your Microsoft 365, you should be able to delete something, but there's no, there's no option here unless you go to here. Right? This has just been added. I don't know why this wasn't here before, but now they added it here. All right, let me go into... Let me go into this one right here. Oh, I can't believe that. Let's go into VR notes. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and delete this. Okay, and what used to happen is it'd still show up in your OneDrive. Let me see. See, VR notes is still here. Let me refresh the page real quick. And it's still here. See, that that's what most people are talking about. You can <laughs> delete it from Microsoft 365, but once you get to OneDrive, it still shows up in, in your OneDrive. I, I don't know why it doesn't sync across all right. your apps. Maybe it's to protect yourself. I, I don't know. Maybe it's like a safety mechanism, but it's it, a lot of people were complaining about it. What I found is there is no delete on this. You can't really, yeah, you, you can't really, you can't really delete it. Oops, let me go back. All right. What the be next best thing you can do is you can hide it. So once you delete, you can go to, you can go to hide. So now it's hidden. And then when you go to your OneDrive and you refresh it, it's no longer here. All right. We're looking for VR notes. It's not here. So I, I know it's confusing, right? Just to summarize everything once again, all right? When you delete stuff from Microsoft 365, okay? You go to here, you go to these three buttons. It still shows up onto your OneDrive. All right, let me, let me go ahead and, oops. Let me go ahead and do that again. All right, so shopping list. Delete. You go to OneDrive, and your shopping list is still here. All right. What you have to do is you have to go back to Microsoft 365, and instead of delete, you hide. Okay. And then from hide, once it's hidden, once you delete it and hit it, it, it no longer shows up here. All right. So. I know it's not the, the, the most ideal situation, but it's the best uh, workaround I've found so far. Until they come up with a new patch and they fix it, then you know this is the next best thing. So I hope this answers your question. I, I know it's a bit finicky to use Microsoft 365, but I, if I ran into this problem, I figured other people would as well. I made this guy to help, help everyone out. If you found this video helpful, can you please hit the like button? Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.